I started playing when I was 21, 51 years ago. What drew me to golf is I played so badly the first day out. The first six or seven swings I made with a crowd behind me waiting to play, I missed the ball. And the next day I went to in the Wilmington and bought a set of clubs. I got an ego, you know, and I said, I, got I love this. It's just out there in the middle of the towns and you just got nothing but this beautiful scenery. And it's really cool, you know. The grass is, is really important and uh, every month we get, you know, four, 40 packs of fertilizers to spread with the, with the tractor. And Arturo does a lot of work cleaning the ponds out and making sure the pumps are working for the ponds and the waterfall and uh, washing balls and, and just taking care of the, the insides. And one of the main things, uh, it's a golf business and it's people friendly business. You've got to have a decent personality and uh, people know that they got to take care of the customers. And when my son was 13, I taught him how to play. And three years later, we had twin boys, Kevin and Christopher, and I taught them how to play, and we used to play together, which was a fantastic thing. And now they're all professional golfers, PGA members, and two of them are head pros. One of them in New York, Tuxedo Park, and one of them in York, Pennsylvania, the Country Club of York. I, I worked in the, in the nuclear division, which used to be down in Wilmington, and they had to close up. 30 years ago, and then I worked for DuPont for 21 years. And then when I, they sold a plant in DuPont, so I got off my mom developed Alzheimer's and I took care of her for a couple of years with a brother of mine. And I needed a part-time job, you know, for the hours I went working there. Saw this in a paper and I said, it's a golf job, I'll take it. I love golf. <laughs>